we've got a great challenge this week. We're back on the road. Um, you know, three of our first five are on the road in the conference, so uh, this is a big game. Obviously, Stephen F. Austin um, is in somewhat uh, of transition, you know, with their coaching situation. Um, so, uh, you, you, you know, they're, they're not winning the games that, that, that a lot of times they may be winning, um, but they've got some really talented players. I, I, I would put their talent level um, at the top, top third of our conference. And when I say that, um, you know, they're going to be as talented as Sam Houston in some areas. They're going to be as talented as Southeastern. They're going to be as talented as, as uh, McNeese State in some areas. Um, their quarterback's a transfer from TCU. He can really throw the football. Um, defensively, they're a very aggressive defense. Uh, they, one, one good thing for us is we played a 3-3 stack defense against Houston Baptist last week, um, and Stephen F. Austin runs a similar defense. So um, to, get to, to get to stack those two teams um, back to back is kind of an advantage to us on offense. Um, but, but it's a big week. It's hard to play on the road. You know, you cherish wins on the road. You cherish wins in general, but especially on the road. You know, um, take that road trip. And then it's a 2 o'clock kickoff. So our alarm clock, our game clock, has to go off a lot earlier than what it's gone off all year. Um, you know, we'll be eating pregame meal at breakfast time, you know, middle, middle of the morning. So um, that's going to be a little different, you know, for our guys. And that's something that we're coaching up. And um, fortunately, uh, we, got, we have fall break this week, so we're going to practice at 2 o'clock game time on Thursday. So that might help us a little bit, too. So, um, so that kind of works out well in our favor. So we're excited about the trip. Again, quarterback situation, um, we're going to – you know, right now it looks like Luke's going to be the starter this week. Again, we, we want Kirk back, and Kirk's going through a, a you know, a, a partial labral tear in his shoulder, and that's a tough injury. I've dealt with that a couple years ago with Taylor and Hayden Hildebrand, Taylor Reed and Hayden Hildebrand. So uh, that's a tough spot to be in. I mean, you, believe it or not, you use your shoulders a lot in football, you know, even if you're a quarterback. <laughs> so um, so it's, it's a tough deal. He's going to have to – He's going to have to continue to get better and get good treatment from Dave and his staff, but, uh, but I have no doubt he'll be back here soon, and, and uh, we'll, continue to, we'll continue to have a bunch of good, good, good problems to have at quarterback. So uh, excited about that, looking forward to the challenge, and, and uh, we'll try to make the most of it. Your incredible lives are what make Arkansas so special. That's why doing our part to keep you amazing is our mission by providing the most skilled doctors and nurses to heal you from sickness or injury and giving comprehensive care to support your recovery, we're your guide to health. All so you can keep on giving, keep on inspiring, and keep on amazing. For the care that keeps you amazing, visit baptist-health.com. Guys, this is this will walk in. This will walk in. And guys, look, these plays we might not even practice. We might not even practice them. All right? But we could have used this play last week and scored a touchdown off of it. All right? So that's why we got to have it in. All right? Now we might work it in RVAs. Okay? But guys, there's a good chance, a good bit of us in here will not practice this route this week. And you might be in the game when you run it this week. All right? So that's why you got to write it down. You got to study your notes. You got to know it. All right? Because these are routes, guys, that will score touchdowns for you. Okay? Guys, outside receivers on the skinny, you're very well in the read this week. All right? When you face teams that play the coverage that these guys play, a quarters coverage, guys, they leave these teams skinny pose, scissors concepts right here. They give these teams fits. All right? It's hard concepts for them to cover. Okay? For whatever reason, this coverage just struggles covering this route concept. So Z's, make sure you get that 18 yards. Again, guys, you see up top, that's number one. Guys, he's gonna try to get his hands on you. One is Duke Upshaw. One is Duke Upshaw. How Duke plays is how one plays. So you gotta be ready to be physical. Look at the skinny post. So I'm telling you guys, scissors concept, this coverage, they struggle versus it. You put pressure on that safety. He's gotta pick somebody to cover. A lot of times he just sees that corner route coming. He says, I got safety help on the post. Little does he know the safety usually doesn't help him on the post. So they're in a world of hurt. Go down and get it. 
Go down and get it. Track it. Track it. Here you go. Two man formation. So you're going to have a dude, you're going to have a dude. We got to get in here. Chase the bubble. He's going to be here. Bam. Good. Here we go. Good. Use your hands. Let's go. Find the ball. Find the ball. It's 2 o'clock kickoff on Saturday. The sun ain't going down because we're playing. Here we go. So start my cut at 12, guys. Start my cut at 12. Yes, that's perfect. That's perfect. Guys, we're running. We're running. We're going to slow down. We're going to go left, right. Coming out. You guys got it. You got a guy trailing you. You're about to break on Hammer or Maverick. Slow down your pace. Going right, left. Coming out. You guys got it? We're working fades right here. Fades. Going up and getting it. You got it? Hold your line. Partner, make sure you're pushing them. Give them pressure. Hold your line. Go up and attack the football. Come down away from the defender. Strong hands. Tuck the ball. Here we go. Go! Go up and get it. Good. Go! Slow down. Right, left. Good. Here we go. Go! Go up and get it. Get two hands on it. I'm money. I'm money. Let's go, uh... Let's go turn, turn, turn. That's me, Luan. I'm money now. I'm in the zone now. Here we go. Side. Here we go. Scissors, scissors, that angle. Hey, see his leverage though, Wayne. You won't make it. Side. Done. That's a quarterback, guys. That's a quarterback. Nice play! Line up in half right jag. On your own left. Fly, you got the Vermont switch. Vermont. You're motioning, you're going to hash. Vermont switch. Here we go. Let's go get out there, Joe. Up the hash, up the hash. Good. I just feel like I'm not living up to the standard you wanted me to. Like I should be making plays. That's that's all I'm coming. I'm not, I'm not mad about the numbers. Like you said, long we won, long get that ring in the day. I'm straight. You feel me? That's yeah. the ultimate goal. You feel me? But like I said, I feel like you expect more of me. And yeah, you. I feel like you're not saying nothing to me. So I'm guessing I'm not doing something right at practice. Because if if I wasn't if I was doing something right, I wasn't doing something, I'd be on my ass. Yeah. Well, and that's my fault. I should have got onto you for your effort and stuff before now. And that's me. This is my expectation of you, Wayne. And you're right. I expect you to come out here in your full speed every single rep. You're focusing on the details every single rep. You're not going through the motions. You're locked in, whether it's in the huddle or getting out on the field. And you're locked in just in meetings is just your presence is felt. You know what I'm saying? That's my expectation to you. Because I know if Wayne G does that, Wayne G's gonna get a touchdown that he wants on Saturday. That's what I'm saying. That's why I always say it in there. Is you can't, you're not a different, we're not different people on game day. We're just not. God didn't make two of us. He made one of us. But we're a creature of our habits. And whether we think it or not, like, oh, I can do this out here and practice and it won't show up in the game. It's gonna show up in the game. Just like out here, you lose focus and practice for whatever reason. And then what, we get in the game, you lose focus on Charger. You know what I'm saying? And so it's like that habit and practice, it did turn out in the game. You see what I'm saying? So that's the thing, and, and you know, I'm, I, dude, I'm pumped about your grades right now. I think you're doing great with it. You're staying on top of it, you're focused with it. But I know out here it gets monotonous. You know, in grades, it's all right, this is a different assignment. 
This is a different assignment this week. Out here though, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday schedule is the exact same. We're doing the same thing. And the, the monotony of it can get old and can get, uh, I don't want to come out here. I mean, I ain't going to lie to you. When I was playing, there was days or twos where I don't, it's like I wanted to come out here, but it wasn't just like, all right, I'm just amped about coming up here. You know what I'm saying? That's why you just got to fight it ourselves. Got to fight that mental thing. Like, all right, Wayne, G, I'm, about, I'm losing focus. Let's get locked back in. Let's get in tune back into what's coming. You know what I'm saying? Because in due time, your time's going to come. You know, punt return this week was great. Well, I, I thought you were aggressive. You made catches. I'm good. I ain't mad at me. I was going to make sure that ain't it. No, I ain't mad at you. I'm proud of you, man. This week, punt returns, I thought you did a good job filling them. You got out. I mean, you averaged 11 yards, which is really big. I mean, if you can average 10 yards on a punt return, that's really good. That's really good. And so I think you got another chance at it this week. You know, and hopefully we can get you to the crib at some point. But but you just got to keep yes, everything matters, and then bam, you never know. You never know it opens up for you. You know what I'm saying? You good, man. Right. You know I love you. you I'm here for you. If you ever got any concern, you always ask me. You know I'm always going to keep it real with you. summer, student-athlete leaders from the Southland Conference's 13 schools get together for a retreat. Before we start another season of competition, there's time to have some fun and bond. We also share experiences of serving our campuses and communities. Together, Southland student-athletes completed more than 30,000 community service hours over the past year. We pull for each other and push to make each other better. Just part of what makes us Southland strong. One and no in a day. One and no, man. Let's go. And we welcome you into Homer Bryce Stadium. Justin Acre, Chris Kane will join RG Hawk on the sideline here in a bit on a beautiful day for football. Some light, fluffy, high clouds. Windy afternoon here and a big game for the Bears to stay on track towards another trip to the postseason. One of the things you have to have on the road. At, a, at the quarterback position is poise. And one of the things that you'll hear from Coach Brown that he was most impressed with, with Luke Hales last week, he said it's really similar to what we saw with Braylon. We want quarterbacks who are poised in the pocket, who are not afraid to make the throws, even if they're a big throw, into coverage. You have to trust your receivers at times that they're going to be in that right spot. And Luke Hales last week showed that Greenwood confidence. We know that uh, the Greenwood brand is confidence because they've won a lot of games, a lot of state titles along the way. And Luke Hales stepped in there like a seasoned veteran, threw five touchdowns, ran for another. And how about that? Six total touchdowns in your first ever collegiate game. Sky's the limit for this kid. The Bears are gelling on the offensive line, which makes everything else easy. You've got explosive players on the outside, and Brandon Myers, who 30% of the time he catches it, he ends up in the end zone. And then Jakari Dillard has had an unbelievable start to his senior season. Another big long touchdown pass, 65-yard reception last week. Uh, re uh, Long touchdown reception, I should say, but 65-yard reception on that touchdown from Hales in his first collegiate pass last week. And then Lester Wells has just been the workhorse. I mean, he's the undersized receiver, tough guy, loves to go over the middle and draw contact. He's done a great job holding on to the football, and he leads the Bears in receptions this season. Uh, he's a guy that really can be counted on. You're mixing in the tight ends. You've got the wild bear package going on. It's a lot to deal with for a defensive coordinator, and certainly it's going to be a lot to handle if you're SFA, a team that has one win on the season and has really struggled so far. Hey, yeah. special effort today. Hey, let's make this our home place. Hey, shut that cow out. Offense keeps going. Let's go on special teams. All night long. All night long. Go for it. Hey, hey, hey. Create turnovers. No turnovers on offense. Hey, we're a long night to win the game. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
ball is out, it's picked up by Reggie O'Dean. 40, 35, 30, 25, 20, he is wrestled out of bounds. A little horse collar tackle, no flag. But Reggie O'Dean, the Bear defensive line, does it again. Reggie O'Dean with the recovery. Man in motion as well. They hand it to the Gosno Express again, and he is into the end zone, running right behind Luke Ross, the tight end in that offensive line. Blackman in for the touchdown. Crossley staying in there, ball on the left hash. Trips receivers to the right side with Lester Wells inside. Brandon Myers alone on the left side. He's got man-to-man -man coverage. Hales throws it over the middle, has his man. It is caught for a first down, Dwayne Smith, who hasn't been real involved in the passing game. Showed some signs as a punt returner last week. A couple of shoestring tackles kept him from busting a big one. Twins receivers left, twins receivers right. But Simmons in motion now goes back out to the right side. Hand off up the middle. The Bears are there. Eric Jackson, hammer time at the 35-yard line. Lays a lick and puts the running back down immediately. Three receivers set for Blomrick. Play action. Under pressure, Chris Terrell buries him at the 24-yard line. He came untouched. And Jake Blumberg's got to wonder what in the world happened up front there. Somebody went to sleep. He's got his man Q out there. Ball dropped by Blumberg, picks it up, and he's hammered down at the 45. So he didn't handle the snap. The snap back was good, Chris. He just let it fall out of his hands. He reaches down, picks it up, and the Bears were all over him. Duke Upshaw right in his face, and he's looking that way. Under pressure, and he is swallowed up. He does fight forward to get back to the line of scrimmage. The Bear D line is pumped. Nathan Grant and his buddies are fired up after that play. Hales throws again out to Crossley across the 30. 35, 40, first down Central Arkansas. Easy throw and catch right there to Crossley. And the Bears said, okay, fine. You won't let us throw it down the field. We'll throw it back here. Hales with Ross set to his right. Battle behind him. Play action. Looking downfield. Throwing outside. Has Myers, who came back and made the grab and got whacked for his trouble. Hales will throw again. To the right side, trying to find Myers. What a catch as he falls to the turf at the 35 yard line. He brought it down. Man in motion is battle. And Cedric Blackman, or uh, Carlos Blackman, set behind. Hales has time to throw outside to Wells, and that's an easier catch for him. Going to the sideline with a defender chasing as opposed to waiting to drill him. So Cummins with an extremely short field goal attempt here. It's going to be all of 19 yards. Ball on the left hash. Good handle there by the holder as he had to reach up and grab it. The kick is up and the kick is good. And a job, good job by Will Seiler there. The snap was just a hair high. Blumrick, good pressure by the Bears and they will sack him down at the 30 yard line. Three Bears play, meet at the quarterback. Jackson, Grant, Terrell, they drop him at the 30 and it will be punt time again. Imagine life without football. No Friday night lights, no pep rallies, no band. All that time invested to teach young men and women commitment and team spirit, gone. Football, where young men and women compete to be the best. Where bands, cheerleaders, and countless others take part in the team experience. Celebrate the passion that only happens every fall. Join the game. Hey, defense! They ain't gonna sniff. They got one big play. That's all they got. Y'all keep stoning them. They can't block y'all, D-line. They can't block y'all. Don't let them. All offense, let's get going. They want to stack nine in the box. We got to make plays. We got one-on-one. -on -one. We got to make plays. Tailbacks, keep running the ball like hard. Keep running it hard. You got me? It'll open up, I promise. All right, here we go. Hey, win on one time. One time. Win. Hustle down. Hustle down. Let's go. Hey, let's go, man. Let's go. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Well, in the backfield. And now he'll put his receiver in motion. They will hand it off up the middle. Bears are there, oh, yeah. and he is stopped short. No game, maybe a half-yard loss on the plate. It's going to be fourth down. That's the formation for Hales. Wiping his hands as uh, Blackman set to his left. Looks right side, double move. Throw down the seam, and Smith. Dwayne Smith got drilled down, but he made a great catch, and he is slow to get up. Blackman set behind Luke Hales. Ball in the middle of the field. Nicks, the tight end, shifts to the right side of the formation. They will hand it to Blackman off the left side. Right behind an offensive lineman, sidesteps the defender, still on his feet. 20, 15, 10, 5, touchdown, Carlos Blackman! And the Bears finally...
finally break through in the run game. What a job up front. Uh, Blackman set behind Hales. As Nix set to the left side. He's going to go quick throw outside to Wells. Nice catch. Across the 40, 45. Stops across midfield. Bumped out at the 49-yard line of SFA. Blackman can throw it as well. Crossley stays on his feet. Great run as he was tripped up. He stumbled forward. He got six more. First down Bears inside the 40-yard line at the 39. Darkening skies. And the Bears trying to add to a seven-point lead here in the third quarter. Crossley, again, left side, cuts it up. Spin move with the 29, or down to the 29, excuse me, spin move with the 32, gets it down to the 29. Another burst of 10 yards. Move those chains again. Over on the right side of the formation. Now he'll go in motion as part of the trips receiver left. Hales, late throw down the sideline. Touchdown, Central Arkansas. He had Lester Wells come up with it. Lester Wells with a touchdown grab in the end zone. I was looking over there. Dillard was driven way out of bounds by the defender, and Wells came right in where Dillard had vacated. SFA trying to punch it in here from the one to start the fourth quarter. Down two touchdowns. Bears trying to hold it here on third and goal from the one. Blumrick will try to run it himself. He is hemmed up. It's taken down by Eric Jackson. No, sir. Lost a two on the play. Great job of that Bear defensive line. In motion to man inside. Ball snapped over his head. Blumrick's chasing it down. It's at the 30. He slides down and grabs it. And it's going to be a turnover on downs back to the Bears. Another huge mistake by the Lumberjacks. And the Bears will take advantage. Are you kidding me? Man in motion as Wells. Three receivers set right now. Hales with plenty of time. Rolling right. Throws underneath to Carlos Blackman. Sidesteps the defender and another. Fights through another for a first down out across the 35. That is all Carlos Blackman. What a play. Play action. Hales outside. Has Wells. Ducks it down to the left side. Then across the 50. 45. Still on his feet. 40. 30. 25. Stops again. Lose the defender. Throw to the turf. And what a play by Lester Wells. He never stepped out. It looked like he nearly did in front of the SFA bench. Kick is up and on the way, and it is good. And the Bears extend the lead 27-10. Nice hold there by Will Seiler. Good snap by Reed Wood, and the Bears extend it. Down 10 with 2.53 to go. Blumrick looking under pressure, and he is down. Loss on the play for the sack. The Bears pile it up, and they just bull rush. Boy, that field goal by Cummins, huge now. Full rush off the left side. Blumrick sacked again. The Bears got him again. Terrell forced him into the arms of Nathan Grant. Bears need to get a stop here. Take a knee and go home. Bears bringing that four-man rush again. Blumrick throws late. Picked off. It is intercepted. And on his feet is Trey Mosley at the 35, and he is buried down there. And that will do it. Bears win. They're a knee away. Coach is next to us, starting to pack it up. I love it. Hey, hey, I talked about a halftime. Sometimes you gotta win games like that. Tough place to play, two o'clock kickoff, dead atmosphere, all those things. And you guys came out in the second half and slapped some dudes around. Defense, y'all freaking were on, uh, y'all were on fire, boys. Y'all were on fire. Hey, hey, y'all see the way them running backs ran? Hey, that's, that's what it's about. Hey, 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 eyes. You win tough ones like that. That's how champions keep going. You understand? It's not going to be easy from here on out, right? You're the hunted, but the hunt that needs to be the hunter if you want to be a champion. Hello. You understand? Hello. Hello. That's what we're going to live by. Every, hey, 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 hey. I love it, man. You guys you guys left it out here. Some big plays made. Also, I mean, shoot. Pass rush, Nate Grant, Free Cardell, CT. Oh, yeah. CT. Oh, yeah. oh, hey, hey. That, hey, that's some nasty stuff there now. Hey, that's nasty. We make them one dimensional. We'll get after them. That's a nice job. Hey, and that hey, hey, you got big plays, make, make players make big plays. I love it. Everybody got me? Yes, hey, let's get in here. Let's shower up. Let's get back to Conway. Let's get ready for the next one. Yeah. Hey, what we got? How many we got? 27. 27. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty, forty, fifty, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, 20, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Hey, hey, hey.